guys, it's Audrey Kishing, fashion blogger, and I'm here with the wonderful Larry Sims at his salon. And we're about to style my hair with Got To Be Smooth Operator. So I'm excited. Come check it out. Hey everybody, what's up? We're here with the fabulous Audrey Kitching and we're going to be doing a how-to on um, a couple of great looks with Audrey. We're going to do a day and night look. We're going to be using the Got To Be Smooth Operator line. It's going to be fantastic. The first look that we're going to do is going to be a really gorgeous braid. It's going to be free-flowing, it's going to be effortless, and we're going to show you how to get that braid at home. Here we go. Okay, you guys, so the first step is as follows. We're going to use Got To Be Smooth Operator Smoothing Lotion. We're going to put it on Audrey's dry hair. And the great thing about this product is that it's infused with cashmere. So. Ooh, cashmere. Yeah. Very it feels very nice against the skin and the scalp. And what it's going to do is it's going to give us a really great smooth foundation that's going to get rid of any flyaways. And it's going to really work great with the blow dryer that I'm going to use to really smooth out that cuticle. Go. Oh, it does smell really good. Doesn't it smell amazing? I want to eat it. Step two, which is basically sealing the cuticle with the product that we've already put in the hair. We really want to seal the cuticle with the Mason Pearson brush, and it's going to give us a really great finish. Okay, so Audrey, seriously, feel this side of your hair and feel that side of your hair. Okay, I'm not just saying it, it's like magic. Isn't it night and day? really big difference. It's crazy. It's crazy. We're neglecting the pink though. You know what? We're going to give that pink a lot of love. Here we go, pink. What we're going to do now is we're going to implement Got To Be's Smooth Operator's Satin Drops. What this is going to do is it's going to really give the cuticle a really nice smooth shine. Okay guys, so we're at step four at this point. What we're doing is, is we're creating a really, really, really loose, organic, really natural braid. The biggest misconception about doing braids is that everybody thinks that they're supposed to be tight, 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 tight. But you're not going to be able to get all of this sexiness that Audrey has going on here with it being tight. So use minimal tension. For the daytime, it's like that beachy, messy look, and then at night, just pop in a cute headband and mm -hmm. it takes it to the next level. Totally. Totally. Okay, so our fifth and final step is here. We're going to use Got To Be's Smooth Operator Smoothing Holding Hairspray. The great thing about this hairspray is that it's a workable hairspray. So you can put your fingers through it, you can switch up your styles through it and it doesn't weigh the hair down or give it some sort of icky film that a lot of other hairsprays like to give. So. Basically, we're going to finish Audrey off. That smells really good. Doesn't it smell great? I love it. And notice that the hairstyle is really organic. It's really natural. It doesn't look like she sat in the salon and got it done. You can do this at home also. Trust me. Using Got To Be's Smooth Operators line. Smooth Operator. <laughs> Yeah? I do. It's like Joan of Arc modern. Yeah, totally. Yeah. I like that it's messy. That's the coolest part. Yeah. When you think braid, you think very like sleek and perfect. And this is like sleek, but it's got that edge to it. Yeah, exactly. 